Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. Hello. 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 Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Hello. Good morning. We have some very sleepy kitties here today. Very sleepy. I'm, I gotta do something today that I have been putting off. I've been procrastinating on this big time because it is getting the kittens ready to be adopted. On the one hand, I'm very excited, so excited. Can't wait for them to find their forever families, their forever homes. I am like ecstatic for them. Also really ecstatic for not having to clean five litter boxes every day. Pretty ecstatic for that. Also, our grocery bill will probably be much uh, cheaper because there's not as many, there's not seven kitties that need to be fed. But gosh, I can't, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do when they're actually gone. I Emotionally, I don't think, I don't know if I'm ready. I'm like so, I got attached, man. Like, yeah, what did I think was gonna happen? I don't know. I thought I could handle it. I, I'm i actually handling it better than Steve's handling it too, believe it or not. He's like way more attached to them. It's hard. I think we're just bad, at, we're bad foster parents. We just can't be, we can't be taking care of kitties and not getting emotionally attached to them. So that being said, we are keeping one. I know, Pfft, I bet you never would have guessed. We were almost thinking of keeping two, but then we're like, yo, that's gonna be four cats. That's, are we four cat people? We don't know, we don't know. You know, we thought we knew who we were, and then five beautiful cats entered our lives, and now we, I don't know who we are, I don't know. So we're keeping one. I don't know if you've guessed uh, by watching maybe our Instagram story, my Instagram stories, or, um, I don't know, this vlog channel. I think I probably highlighted this particular kitten a little bit more, but we are keeping Tom Collins. He's just a standout. <clears throat> I mean, they're all, they're all so friendly. They're the friendliest kittens, the most well-behaved, friendliest kitten. Whoever gets them is gonna be just the luckiest person. I'm just so, I just love them all so much. They're all just so unique and like they each have their own little personalities and they're so, 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 so sweet. But this one in particular, Tom Collins, he every single morning screams to be let out and not to get food or, or run around the house or anything like that. He just wants to hang out. He just wants to follow me everywhere I go, or if Steve comes in, he wants to follow Steve, or if Franklin or Joe come in, he wants to follow them. He's very fair with the distribution of his love. He doesn't like blatantly pick a favorite, although he does follow me the most, not gonna lie. Also, uh, Franklin and Joe really love him. They play together, they lick each other, they just, it's like they were all meant to be together. So, did I plan on keeping Tom? No, no, I did not. But he is, we've all fallen in love with him, like the whole family, Franklin and Joe and Steve, oh, Steve, all of us have fallen in love with him. He just, he can sit for hours in here too, chilling with Franklin while I'm working on the computer. He is, I, he is the most well-behaved kitten. I, the kittens are usually running all over the place. He's, he runs all over the place, but not, He's pretty chill. Like he, he'll just sit on my lap and purr for hours. It's just so sweet. I can't. The thought of letting that particular kitten go, I can't do it. I have. We have to keep him. So we failed. We failed at just being fosters. We failed at not adopting. Um, we're definitely. We definitely have to keep him. So welcome to the family, Tom Collins. He's not here right now. I think he's in Steve's office. But yeah, we've been slowly like um, letting him come out while the other kittens are still in the kitten room. We can't have them all out at the same time because they just get too wild and um, Franklin and Joe get too scared and they hide under the bed all day. And so um, yeah, we'll just let one out at a time usually. But Tom, we've been letting out most of the day unless he like cries to go to his particular litter boxes. But um, he's been kind of getting more used to like being part of the family the past couple weeks. So I'm uh, super excited about that. It just really, I, it's been a long time since I've had a kitten. 
Uh, Joe was the last kitten that I owned and he was a kitten in 2011. So it's been nine years since I've had a kitten. Like that's our kitten. And it's our, it's Steve and I's first kitten together. Cause Franklin and Joe were my cats and then I got together with Steve. So even though they've adopted Steve as, his, as their stepdaddy, um, this is the first cat that we've, or any pet, any sort of pet that we've gotten together. So that's, that's sweet. We were trying for a human, but you know, a kitten will do in the meantime. So yeah, that being said, the thing I'm doing right now is um, I gotta take some really, really quality, some quality ass pictures of these fools and I gotta create like little bios for them that highlight their unique individual personalities and then um, I submit them and they get posted to several sites online and and then people can, are gonna start adopting them and there's there's nothing I can do about it and there's nothing I wanna do to stop that but I'm also, I'm, I'm gonna need a minute as each one leaves cause it's gonna be real, it's gonna be real sad for us um, in a happy way, a bittersweet way. It's, it's bittersweet, but yeah. So I'm gonna go take some pictures of some kittens now. <sighs> oh, I just love them so much. We're gonna miss them, huh, Franks? We're gonna miss them. The sky is gray, times are changing. This is the end of everything. But it's hard to say goodbye. Hello, good morning. We're on JK News today. Yo. Both of us. Good morning. I'm hosting, but... Are you hosting the morning ones? No, I'm hosting the afternoon ones. Oh, sorry. But I haven't really looked at all the articles yet. So. But they're all like really funzy articles because it's the election and we everything's like really chaotic right now so we're trying to stay away from all of that yeah. so it's it's really like articles like uh an octopus escaped from the aquarium wouldn't you know? it be fun if we were all tigers yeah yeah did Perfect. you know if you were a tiger you wouldn't have stress hormone that we have or whatever did you know if you were a tiger that means you're guaranteed to have friends because tigers always have friends dang i wish i was a tiger i know that's sad they're cool they're cool. They're flirting. Oh, God damn, flirting. Nikki. flirting. It's been a crazy week. It was my birthday. Um, it was a U.S. election. It's which, still your birthday. Which is still, it's still a U.S. election. <laughs> but it's also today is Guinness's last day with us. Well, it's actually... Yesterday was Guinness's last day with us. Today, Guinness is fine going to his forever home, and it's bittersweet because we love him so much. But he's also getting a forever home, and so we're happy, right? We're, we're, sad. we're happy, <laughs> right? We're happy. It's so hard, man. We're happy. Oh man. We're happy. <laughs> he's so cute. Yeah. Yeah, he's actually going to um, one of my high school best friends. How homes with her kitty and she's a very 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 good cat mom so i'm really excited that she that he'll be in good hands and that we'll probably get to see him again because she's my friend um she's been a lot of vlogs mm -hmm. a lot of vlogs mm -hmm. so I'll, I'll be sure to vlog him there but it's still sad because we love Guinness and he's the first to go he's the one that got the most applications right away too and then Gigi got a lot of applications too. Imagine letting the rest of them go to places we can't go visit. I know. That's, that's what's going to happen. I know. It's it's so sad. Ugh. Fostering's it's hard, shit. man. Fostering's God. really hard. It's like I'm so excited for them to get their forever homes. And also, I'm so sad. I'm just going to miss them. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. We love you, Guinness. Look at this little boy. They all clean themselves after eating. Yeah, so sweet. their mom, mama found that. So sweet. Tom, that's not your food. It's technically his food. It is now, that's yeah, true. He's in the family now. Tom's got his forever home too. Yeah, that's right. I guess Tom was the first to go. Yeah, that's true, he just went out, out here. Yeah. <laughs> Sweetie. Who 
really sweetie. Say bye to everybody. Yeah. What a cutie. What a cutie. You're okay. You're okay, buddy. You're going to a good home. Guinness, do you love your new home? It's your big water bowl. Oh, <laughs> thanks to the salt lamp. Is this not like the perfect home for him? This is like he just looks like he belongs here. <laughs> this is Guinness's new mom. This is Tanya. You probably recognize her from a bunch of other vlogs. Um, years and years of bachelorette party <laughs> vlogs yes. and birthday party vlogs. Anyway, she got me she got me a plant for my birthday mm -hmm. and a bunch of other gifts. Mm -hmm. Cause she's dumb. So dumb. Why would you do this to me? It's just tissue paper. So cute. I love this plant. She just explained to me how I killed my last plant that was like this. I didn't know you're supposed to water inside of there. Oh. But now I know. <gasps> he loves it. Here. He's gonna snuggle you tonight. Oh my god, that's all I want. This date is going so well. Dude, my friend is so talented. <laughs> Look at her. Look at what she does for a living. She makes like she makes like creatures and then you make them all come to life during Halloween, like a Halloween event. You do more than that. This is not yeah. just this is not the only aspect of it. But I just can't believe this stuff comes out of your brain. And then she <laughs> so she makes a clay version of it and then she make when you make a mold mm -hmm. and then you pour the mm -hmm. silicone into the negative mm -hmm. of yeah, the mold exactly and then it becomes a mask and then a person is that oh you like make creatures i make monsters you I make monsters, monsters. <laughs> yeah. i don't think i'm ever gonna have kids yeah now that monsters. you're the mother of this monster too yeah. he's like checking out the litter box he's so excited he's so excited this could not have gone better. I know. <laughs> this is like truly a wonderful day. <laughs> Though the wind is very cold, you hold me, try to melt my soul, makes it harder.